Hey Earth Energies, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn, Ascendant, Sun, Moon, Venus, Rising on this cross-watching and welcome to your Tower Love Messages here. Today we're going to take a look at what is it that you need to know right now at this point in time regarding your romantic connection, your relationship. So what is it to, you need to know about this energy, um, their energy, what is it that you need to know about this, you know, connection here. Uh, we'll see what the cards hint at or maybe even caution against with regards to this connection. Um, this is going to be a general reading, guys, so the messages, they are going to be general. Please just keep that in mind. If you are after personal tarot reading with myself, please feel free to reach out and inquire. I will list my email address just below the video here. So I'll give the cards a shuffle and see what's coming in. Okay, we have the Six of Wands here, Ten of Pentacles, Nine of Pentacles, and the Eight of Swords. Okay, the Six of Wands, for a lot of you, I feel like you're on the right path here, guys, okay? So for those of you that, you know, if even if you've just recently met this person, I feel like this is someone whom you, um, you were destined to meet, so... Um, I feel like this is all a part of destiny playing out. You guys are on the right path. For those of you that are in a relationship, I'm also um, getting the message that um, you are where you need to be. You are with the person who you need to be with. Okay, Everything here is working out um, perfectly um, according to divine timing, div uh, divine timing, sorry, divine intervention here. So everything is exactly as it should be. Um, and things in the future, I feel like, will flow um, very fluidly, very organically, very naturally between the two of you. So I'm seeing that there's going to be a lot of forward momentum here in the future regarding your romantic relationship, regarding the person that you're with. For, for those of you that are single, I feel like there is someone um, new in, coming in for you. This is someone very charming, someone very positive, very confident. Um, I feel like he or she may even be quite... Uh, there's a public platform that they stand on, so they could be quite well known. I'm not sure if they're internet famous here or they're just very known and respected for what they do. Um, very, very financially secure, very financially independent, very, um, very confident here. Okay, um, and the, or this person, like I like I've mentioned, they could be like, because um, I feel like the public has access to them. So, you know, if they're not internet famous, they could be a celebrity or just very. Um, very well known here. Um, for others of you, um, the message that I get is, yeah, the especially for those of you that are in a relationship, I'm seeing you're feeling very confident, as is your partner. The two of you feel very confident about what you have, and I'm seeing that there's going to be a lot of traction here, a lot of forward momentum. Things are happening, and they're going to happen very quickly, but I don't get the impression that anything is rushed. It feels very natural. It feels organic, which is great, guys. Um, I'm also seeing that it's, poss it's possible that because this is positive movement, movement in the right direction. You're on the right path, and you're going to where you are. Where, you know where you need to be, and you're also going to be heading to where you need to go here. So this is great. Um, for some of you, I'm seeing that this is someone whom you're going to get um, a he like news of uh, engagement or even marriage here for a lot of you here. So this is the person who uh, might pop the question here. Um, the person that you might get engaged to or married um, with. For those of you that are currently working towards something with this person, like for instance a business, some of you I feel like you're starting to build up a business of some sort, I'm seeing that you're going to be very successful because there's a lot of movement there. For others of you, you know, if you've been like developing plans for the future, moving in together, buying a house, investing in a property, you'll also be quite successful because I'm seeing that there's a lot of, this person that you're with is a very shared energy, okay? So this person is um, a team player and I feel like the two of you work really well together. Your energies really complement each other here. So I'm seeing that there is something here that you're doing together for a lot of you. Okay, so whether it's a business idea, whether it's like um, you might end up working together, um, building a home, renovating, buying a home, um, any shared goals or shared intentions, a lot of you are actually moving towards it. Um, the Ten of Cups here, um, for those of you that have recently started out, I and it's just early days, but this person is very sure of you. You will be meeting their family very quickly here. This person wants to pull you into their circle closer here. So you'll be meeting their best mates very quickly, their family, their friends, their you know, inner circle, their, their world here. 
and um, similarly they want to meet yours so they want to be a, become a part of your world to become a lot more closer to you in that sense here for others of you I'm seeing there is talks of family this is someone who does want a big family or they do come from an extended family here um, I'm also seeing that this is someone who is in it for the long haul. This is someone who wants to build um, a future with you, okay? They want, you know, a family. Um, they potentially might want to get a family business going here. Um, this is someone who I feel like wants commitment, stability. Uh, this is someone who's very loyal, very dependent, he very reliable. So what the two of you have right now is... You're building a very strong foundation here for the future. A very healthy, sturdy, unshakable foundation here for the future, guys. A lot of you, you're going to be living your best life with this person. Or for those of you that are um, single, this person is coming in for you. He or she is living their best life, okay? Um, a very independent kind of energy. But I feel like with the Nine of Pentacles, it does signal that there is harmony. So for those of you that have been in a relationship or in a marriage or a partnership and you've been trying to work through something, um, I'm seeing um, a very harmonious energy here. Um, for others of you, I feel like with the Nine of Pentacles, I'm seeing that there is going to be discussions, talks about the future very soon, or the two of you are in the midst of discussions and talks about the future here. Um, I'm also seeing um, a lot of you are going to be deciding, you're going to be talking or deciding when you know when to take this to the next level again i think things are happening very quickly in this connection in this relationship um but don't get me wrong i don't feel like it's rushed it doesn't give me the impression that it's rushed or you know it's just hurried it, it feels very natural it feels like it feels right here guys okay with the eight of swords energy here i'm seeing that some of you are some of you you need to be careful that you don't let like a host of negative emotions or a host of negative feelings keep you apart in, the, in this connection in this relationship okay make sure any issues or any concerns that you have about the connection or about the plans for the future that you're discussing make sure you voice yourself okay because i feel like if you stay quiet um or if you have like negative emotions or feelings here they will have this power to unfortunately drive you apart so i feel like the eight of what uh, the eight of swords sorry is telling you that you know keep keep your feelings here um open and honest here and make sure the two of you really communicate with one another here because i feel like excuse me that's really going to allow you to connect on a more deeper level here guys um it also suggests to me that you know any issues you are able to fix um quite Maybe not easily, but quite fluidly, just by communicating, by talking it out, guys, with the Eight of Swords, okay? So if there's something that's concerning you, don't fixate on it. Talk about it. Talk about it, discuss it, put it out in the open. Don't just dwell on it and pretend that it doesn't bother you when it really does. And same goes for, for your partner, you know? Any issues about the ex or about past or any issues about um, concerns about the present, current relationship or the few you know future plans here talk it out okay don't pretend it doesn't bother you don't feel like it's going to go away here on its own it won't not until you talk it out and clear it out all right guys and these are your messages thank you for watching and listening please show your support by subscribing to this channel liking sharing and commenting i will be sharing with you more tarot love messages stay tuned bye for now